Okay, I am uh, Professor Ephraim Inbar, Professor of uh, Political Studies at Bar Ilan University, and I am uh, also the director of the Begin Sadat Center for Strategic Studies. Uh, basically, uh, there will always be people that uh, are not satisfied and they'll use violence. Uh, we have to uh, work together to put them in jail, and, but, and the others that have inclinations to try to educate them. But, uh, well, religion definitely can be a bridge uh, to peace. Um, unfortunately, there are uh, people uh, in each religion that uh, adopt a very radical version of their religion, and they cause problem. And um, some, some of them become terrorists, actually. So um, we have to try to uh, uh, minimize their impact on, on our societies, to try to isolate them, and if necessary, to take uh, forceful measure against uh, their organizations. So inshallah, one day uh, they will be educated and they'll choose the right verses, as you mentioned, from the Quran in order uh, to make sure that they have good relations with the Jewish people. Well, I, I'm not sure the Ottoman uh, example is the right example. After all, uh, the, the Jews were a millet, a separate millet within uh, the Ottoman Empire, which was uh, basically a, a caliphate. Uh, it was a Muslim rule, which was, of course, very tolerant o of Jews. And nowadays, we have a different situation in which uh, the Jews have established their own state, uh, a sovereign state. And I think there are Muslims, uh, because of uh, their own religious convictions, have uh, religious difficulties in uh, viewing uh, the Jews as uh, a separate nation. But I think uh, Egypt at this particular moment is ruled by uh, President Morsi, a representative of the Muslim Brothers. Um, I think uh, he doesn't uh, view lightly uh, the existence of Israel, although he behaves somewhat pragmatically. If uh, he will switch uh, his position to a more uh, forthcoming uh, approach toward Israel, Israel will, uh, will welcome it. Uh, of course, uh, Turkey is the same. Uh, Israel, most Israelis think that uh, Turkey is uh, not only a beautiful country, but also a, an important country in the Middle East. Uh, and uh, uh, Israelis uh, had good memories from uh, visiting uh, so many times uh, Turkey. I myself. Uh, have been uh, for many years uh, a regular visitor of your country, and I still have a lot of friends, and uh, I deplore the current political relationship between our two countries. Uh, and uh, hopefully uh, one day, uh, you know, the politicians will come to their senses and uh, will renew uh, this uh, uh, partnership uh, in, the, in the region. Yeah, I think that you are correct in uh, describing uh, Turkish-Israeli relations as a natural uh, partnership, as a natural alliance. And um, eventually, I believe, uh, uh, with the removal of, uh, of uh, the AKP government, I think uh, eventually our two countries will be able to renew their friendship. I am very happy to hear it. I, I've always... Uh, and known that there are liberal elements uh, within uh, uh, the Islamic uh, faith, and uh, hopefully uh, they will uh, prevail. Uh, after all, we've seen uh, uh, in recent pa past uh, Muslim societies that have not been radicalized, uh, such as Indonesia or Malaysia. So definitely there is a potential for a, a different outcome.